Hi, hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tiara. I am the person here at the Love Stitch Knits podcast. You can follow me on Instagram at the Love Stitch and welcome if you are new here and welcome back if you're returning. Um, wow, I'm really trying to to, <laughs> to do better at my intro. Um, hopefully that was a little bit better. But today I wanted to do a little plan with me and uh, just kind of do this process with you guys. Every Monday, I Sunday or Monday, I tried to come and set up my next week and my Hobonichi weeks. And then sometimes I'll do catch up um, on any journals that I didn't catch up in. So I'm pretty sure I didn't write anything in this one yesterday, but I meant to and I tended to. And I didn't finish Sunday's entry in my home in two weeks. So I'll go ahead and throw that out here. And then we can also do some little plan together stuff in this one. And I can set everything up. Um, you can see which stickers I pick and try to pick a theme and we can just go through all that process together. So maybe you can get your supplies too and we can do this as a little activity. I don't know, this is so awkward. I'm still not fully here, obviously. <laughs> I'm doing my best. But it's Monday, so we gotta put up this next week in our journal. Uh, we'll start here though. We will start here and I'm just gonna go in and write in my yesterday, if I can remember what happened. Let's see. I think yesterday was a good day. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> so I'm going to also be like going through my stickers and things and trying to find stickers I want to put in to my pages as well. If I feel like I want to add stickers anywhere. I try to go ahead and do that too. Um, I think that's lots of fun. Oh, there's like a little roller skate. We went roller skating for my husband's cousin's birthday. She turned 11, and so we went roller skating. And that's really cool and a lot of fun. We went there and whenever we, they're Filipino, so um, they have like a big family and they love to get together and eat together. So we always try to do that. Look at how cute these stickers are, by the way. Like they have uh, this little knitting sticker. This was a sticky club pack. This one, I don't know what month it was, but it's called the In The Moment pack. It came with these little notes, it came with a stamp, and it came with all these little stickers about living in the moment. So there's these ones, I have like a stack of books and some journal supplies, some plants, lots of little things, a little embroidery hoop here, some painting. This one has more making, this one has like baking stuff. This one says slow down and it has yarn and like some buttons. This one says read a book, some plant things. It has these really nice Sorry, I'll try to make sure I can, you guys can see these, but this one looks like they're just doing some good activities. Sky seeing, what's that called? Telescoping? I don't know. Sports, art, gaming, planting or something, music, I don't know. Spending time with animals, that's really cool. This one has some self-care mantras. Draw something, self-care, work hard and snack after, create, let's chill, allow yourself to recharge, some food, <laughs> and these cute little moths that are practicing self-care. And then it came with some big stickers too. I don't know, I think that the Sticky Club um, subscription packages get like better and better and they're like so cute and so fun. I really enjoy them. They... I don't know, I really enjoy them, it's really cool. <laughs> oh my god, look, this moth is like, she's knitting. Look at her. 
These are so cute. I might stick this like in the front of my notebook or something. Wait, there's some moths in here. I wonder if one of the moths in here are knitting. If we are so lucky. I never open this, obviously. And if you can tell already, this is like a really rambly, random video. I have no idea what's going on. This one said like cooking for moths. This one is doing... What is that? Oh, uh... Hoop embroidery? Hoop embroidery? And then this one is doing like... Uh, some sort of art, I think. Maybe he's drawing on stuff? Tattoos? What is that? I don't know. I don't know. That's so cute. I wish one of them was knitting, but that's okay. <laughs> I do like cross stitch, so maybe I'll use the cross stitchy one. I don't need to put this back in there. I don't like plastic packaging. I hate it. I'll put these back in here. I'm rambling. I'm so sorry. I just... <laughs> I get really excited about my stickers. Oh, I love them. I was trying to actually see if one of these had like food, like eating food, but that's okay. It doesn't, but. Um, do I have a washi that might? Oh, and then I have also here, this is a little pencil case. It's round, I guess. And in here I just, I just put some washies that I like to use. I have a white skull. My collection is a lot bigger than this, but uh, these are the ones that I pulled out for this video for, to be using for this video. And it's going to get messy, so I hope that you guys are okay with that. But I want this up here to match down here. I think this purple washi right here is from Whimsy and Lace Studio. Oh, If I told you I just dropped my washi in my coffee, would you believe me? Because that's exactly what just happened. So, give me a second. <laughs> oh my god! Let's just act like that didn't happen. Um, I'm going to pretend like this washi is not going to smell like coffee and it's going to be completely useful and that's not going to make me sad and stop working. It's from Whimsy and Lace Studio. It's my favorite washi. So I hope it's not broken from the coffee spill. What did we do yesterday? I don't even know if we did anything yesterday that's worth noting, to be honest with you. That's why I'm supposed to write all this. That's what the planner's for, am I right? Did I even write it down yesterday what we did? No. I'm gonna have to wing this. I don't know what's going on. you'll see over here I'm just writing my task that I did yesterday but I'm gonna write it as today's task and then I'm gonna write it and then I'm gonna check it off because I did it that's that's pretty much how I do things like if I'm memory planning in the to go back I will go ahead and act like I did things and I think that's really funny but I can't be the only person who does this
now I'm just putting a few stickers down and a little bit of washi tape down. It doesn't really matter to me what I put down. I just think that it should look a little bit prettier. Um, honestly, I don't do like super perfect spreads in here. Um, but yesterday I did make some kalvi chin for my family, which is just like braised short ribs. Uh, Korean style and I wrote about that and I wrote about like all the other crap I did yesterday basically just more just a bunch of chores uh, which was just fine uh, so I just wrote about that nothing too long honestly I don't plan to write um, every single day about what I did in here I just want to journal I don't know I just want to write stuff so I do <laughs> That's okay. I went to write, so I write. Um, let's put that there. Uh, I don't know why this happened. I don't, maybe I'm putting the washi on the page too tight. <laughs> but like sometimes I'll put the washi on and it'll curl the page up. Um, maybe like this one too. I don't want it to be too, 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 too plain. Add some color. That's fine. It's not perfect. Who cares? Alright, so that's that there. Go ahead and put this away. So that was just the memory memory planning, the journaling I did for yesterday. I just wanted to write about my um, day there. And then we will get to my Hobonichi weeks. So in here, I have to fill in my entry for yesterday, everything that I did, and my habit tracker, and then we'll go on to the next week where we kind of set it up, like do the whole setup. So here is this. And I'll go ahead. Let's see. Drink water, I had a fresh fruit, I brushed my teeth, and I hugged Ariana Kiss Gabe. I didn't take my vitamin. I haven't been taking my vitamin. Oh well. Um, let's see, I had my benefits call and I edited my YouTube video. I was gonna post on yesterday, Sunday, but I ended up posting it today, Monday. So if you wanna see my 2023 planner lineup, that is I'll put the card up there, but that's up on my YouTube as well. Um, that and now we are here on the next page and we use a little clip here to try to keep the page closed so, this is the hard part where I try to decide um, <laughs> what stickers I'm going to use and I have a lot of stickers to go through and try to choose but I'm thinking maybe I want to do like a green frog theme <laughs> so we're going to look for some froggy stickers that I could use um, I think I have some in mind I did a uh, froggy swap with a friend um, then December and so we sent each other frog things and they sent me some stickers, some frog stickers. So this is just one of my many sticker albums. It's horribly full with stickers. I need to definitely find a better system. I don't want to use those stickers. Uh, 
Starry Night, Twisted Nature, Coffee theme, Mushroom theme. One day, I think I want to do a video where I go through all of these, and maybe you guys would like that, or maybe you wouldn't and be super annoying. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Plants and Noodles. This is just random stuff. Look at these trick or treat guys, they're so cute. Uh, I have a winter theme one here. Here they are. These are the frog stickers I was talking about. Well, let's see if I can get a better view for you guys. So they're like these glittery guys. And they're actually from Sticky Club. Wait. This is the front. <laughs> there they are. And these, these are actually from Sticky Club, which is really cute and cool. Uh, so we have these guys. The glittery. Um, oh, I also have these guys. These are kind of autumnal. That's pretty cute. Maybe. Maybe. Sometimes I like to mix them. Like I'll mix a couple sheets together. Chronic mm -hmm. Porter. These are cute. These might make me change my theme to whatever this is. That's really cute. Oh, I have two of these. That's great. It's like, it's not fall, but I don't know. I'm in a brown and green kind of mood. So we will see. We will see. Some Halloween stickers, but some you know, I think sometimes people like to associate frogs with Halloween, so I just want to check. Have frogs a Halloween thing? I don't think so. I think I'm lying. It <laughs> and then it is. okay. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I'm so sorry, it's been like four hours since I was last, since I recorded the last bit of crypt training Jonah, it's my son, so he had, didn't do too well with his naps today, um, so I just decided to wait until after bedtime, after my daughter goes to sleep, and after my son goes to sleep, to film. And so now I'm back and I'm ready to set up my Hobonichi weeks. Um, I think I was saying before I wanted to do a frog theme, <laughs> so we're gonna do a frog theme. Um, so we're picking out some frog stickers to try to use um, in our and then the Hobonichi this week. <laughs> oh my goodness, I feel like I'm all over the place and have been thrown off, but it's okay. We're we back. Hmm, we're in a good place. Quite a bit of stickers, random stickers in here. Some Pipu Studio stickers. These are some really funny stickers. What if we use what if we use these ones, guys? Look at these froggy people. And it's like really like I don't know. This one's like really autumnal. Not autumnal. But, well, I guess it is pretty autumnal. I don't know why I want to do like a fall theme so bad, but no, I think these are a good match. What are these? Penguins? Dress up? Summer? Oh. We'll use these ones. I think this is a good... These three are a good start. So let's use these three. Alright, so... We're going to use these stickers, and then I went ahead and grabbed um, some more of those, uh, the, what are these? Oh yeah, the Pentel Food Touch brush pens. I have them in the color brown, yellow ochre, and then this one is 
uh, olive green. So I have these three colors. They're a really fine match, I think. So let's let's do some setting up. I do the same process like almost for each each time, like the same process each time, which is finding washi I like. So finding washi I like, and then I'll do like skinny washi here, big washi here, and then like some sort of variation of like corner stickers, and then like some small stickers on this side. So um, I think we'll do this washi. So we'll do this washi, which is like a green color with this little gold foil stuff on it. This one is from Tiny Plant. Uh, what other washi will we do? Maybe th also this green one too. This one is MT brand. It's got like maybe flowers on there. Um, I wonder if I have any brown washi tapes in here. I have uh, this one that has frogs on it. This one is from Jisupi. So it's got these flower, these little flowers and these little frog guys on here, which I think are really cute. And then I have this other washi tape from um, Tidy Plant Kiana. So, so yeah, I think that these ones are the ones that I'm going to try to use in this spread. I think they will go pretty good. So. I need to stock up on like skinny washi though because I don't like when I don't have enough of them. So pull those out the way. And then place the washi down. Put that one there, and I think put the pink one down here. So now that I have the washi down, <laughs> that took me a while, now that I have the washi down I'm going to try to go in and fill up the space in here with some stickers. I'm going to use this um, little, this little, um, little Midori uh, little calendar situation thing sticky note situation I'm gonna use like this little sorry I'm gonna use this little uh, Midori sticky note calendar situation on the page to because I covered up the calendar here at the bottom so I want to go ahead and make a new one
So I made up my little calendar and I put a few little um, little stickers here around it. So I'm going to try to go ahead and stick some of these other things in here. They're not really, um, I don't have a really like a process or anything on like how I do this. I kind of just do whatever I want and then um, no rules, just putting stickers down wherever I want. Just fun. All fun. Oh, this sticker is delicate. I'm, I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't want to rip it. When I'm sticking stickers on this side, I like to try to keep it like on the lines, in the margins, but somewhere where it'll mostly be out of the way so that I have plenty of space to write. And sometimes it doesn't work out perfectly. So I definitely have to like do my best. I don't know. I don't know. Just do my best. Here's a little tip. If you feel like your stickers are too sticky, put them on the back of your hand and then take them off. That way it takes a lot, like the oils of the back of your hand will take off some of the stickiness. So you'll be able to move your stickies, your stickers a little bit better. And if you mess up your placement, they won't be stuck there forever. You know, you can move them around again. I think that might be enough stickers. So, because we still have to write in like my information. So, I think that's enough stickers for now. We will move on. And then usually I'll do like that. And then if I feel like I need to add more stickers or if I feel like I could add more, then I'll go back in after that. So, let's put these to this side. And then, how will we do this? We want to be able to write down. Um, the same thing. So we want to be able to write down my homework assignments, my habits, and my to-do list, which I've left enough space to do. So maybe I want to do my homework will be here. And then homework, and I guess habits, and then my to-do list will be here. So Let's do the habits first. Habits. Habits. And I'll use this brown marker. Um, I don't always know how I'm going to write these headings in here. I write them however I want to. However I want to. Um, I'm almost convinced that I should put two beads, two B's and it should be habits, like ribbit, but that's dumb. <laughs> that's dumb. That's really dumb. Let's not do that. Yeah, I like that. Okay, so we'll do habits there. And that's kind of big. I don't know why I wrote that so large, but it will be okay. <laughs> 
it'll be okay. I'm like this. This how this process usually goes. I'm usually just winging it and doing my very best not to make something super ugly. But I also like I like I also have white out. So like if I really don't like what I did, I will just white it out. Just white it out and act like it didn't happen. I know it's annoying to watch me flip back and forth over and over and over again to try to make sure that I'm doing everything the same. I don't know. I always do that. I always try to like make sure everything is the same. Even though I've done this a hundred times and I do the same thing the same way every single time, I still like to flip back to make sure that um, I'm not making any mistakes. So I've gone in and I've written... Um, the days of the week here, the task here, and then I draw like the little line underneath and here and I do that with the friction pen just in case I'm making any mistakes. I just want to, or if I make any mistakes, I'd like to be able to erase them. So that's that. And then I'll go ahead and write in my task. And my tasks are drink water. Take vitamin. Um, drink water, take vitamin, fresh fruit, what else is there to do, oh yeah, brush my teeth, and hug Ari. And kiss Gabe. So as I do those in the week, I'll go ahead and check them off, and that will be super cute and really. Um, it's always nice to see everything, the dots get filled in here. Whether I do them or not, doesn't really matter. It's just good habits, good habits, good practice. I'm gonna have like a little space here, so I'm gonna go ahead and I think I will. back out I will go ahead and add a little mushroom guy there I'll put another mushroom just like that and fill up that space and then take my next marker I think I want to use the green one I will t take some space and then this one took almost three, so I'll take almost three on this one too, and I'll write in homework. Okay, here we go. Pray don't mess this up. I always think that um, homework is the hardest word to write. Um, I don't know why, but I always have such trouble writing it and I write it like every single week and I don't always, and for that reason I don't always write it um, with a brush pen because I don't like to mess up. line. That should be a thick line too. A thicker line. Um, and to use like the brush pen, I kind of just use the the general rule that every downstroke should be a thicker line. Um, so if you go down, thick, down, down, down. All right. So it's all pretty good. So I think that was pretty good. I don't want to mess with it too much or I'll risk <laughs> making a mistake. And I'll do the same thing. I'll put the little black line right under the word homework. I think that's really cute. You know, sometimes I do this and I think it's way too cluttered. And sometimes I do it and I think it's fantastic. So you never know what you're going to get here. 
Um, as of right now, I think it looks really cute. <laughs> um, so then I have to go ahead and write my homework assignments in... Uh, right now for classes I'm taking statistics and sociology, and I really like them so far. I don't really know anything about them, but I like them. So I've written in my homework assignments for uh, this week in here as well. And now the last section is the to-do section. And there's a pretty good space I'll write to-do here. And then I'll be able to write my task there. And then on my to-do list this week, I will go ahead, not this one, I will go ahead and write some task in here. Uh, so annoying, I'm so sorry. I'll write that we need to grocery shop, and then a giant, and then we need to shop at um, H Mart. Okay. So I just wrote in some things here. Go to grocery store, submit my half grant application, and then my um, my associate's grant. I have to contact my school about that. Um, and then I leave extra little space down here just in case I need to add anything. In. And then I have some more space here so I can add another sticker. Maybe the little other acorn on here. Be a good guy to put in right there. And then it looks pretty good. Um, maybe. That's really good. So there's the there's the spread for this week. I really like it. I really like how it came out. Um, and then I'll go ahead and fill in Monday since it is Monday. We will go ahead and write what happened today. So Martin Luther King Jr. Day today, and it was no school for Arya today, and no work for Gabe today. And then Gabe did some cleaning, and we did. On a crib training, and we, 
I did my Hobonichi spread today. And I posted my YouTube video, my planner lineup. And we had spaghetti for dinner. And I'll go ahead and I drink water today. I had fresh fruit today, brushed my teeth, and I hugged my and kissed my family today, but I did not take my vitamin again. I don't know why I struggle so much for taking my vitamin, uh, but I was ready to do it. And that's everything. So this is how it all turned out. This is my Hobonichi Weeks spread for this week. Like I said, I really enjoy doing this kind of kind of bullet journaling sticker fied situation here. I don't want my Hobonichi weeks to be plain. I want it to be I want each week to be themed and pretty and even though it says the same craft every week, just have a little bit of different um uh style going on. Sometimes I like to do really cartoony and cute and then sometimes I like to do something a little bit more serious and brown so it really depends on how I'm feeling it depends if there's a holiday like I like to do themes for the holiday so hopefully I get to keep on doing these little plan with me videos and if you really like these plan with me videos let me know in the comments and please um, of course like this video if you liked it and subscribe if you're not subscribed yet so we can see more of each other because I would really enjoy that um, Thank you so much for tuning in this week. I can't wait to see you later this week or next week. Hopefully it's next week. I can't see, I guess in the next video, right? Um, anyways, I love you so much. My name is Tiara. You can follow me at The Love Stitch. I hope you enjoy these stupid ramblings I always do at the end of my video. So annoying. I'm annoyed by myself. I love you so much. You're the best. Goodbye.